deal with Bobski. Something he's definitely not going to be ready for. It might allow a bomb plant at a bare minimum here for Mad Lions. And indeed it has. Rush arrives a little bit too late to stop the plant. Bobski domes the first. Oh, and the follow up on Duovo. Now, looking oh. for even more. It falls onto Rush in the 1v1. Bobski. Oh, no way. Not. 1v4. And he locks it in. Jack's up close, needs to win this battle. It's not easy against the Glock, but with low health, Roy was in trouble. Either way, though, the headshot definitely finishes him off. Bubski now the last man left standing. The bomb not planted for him, unfortunately. It's Amanek, though, who had that defuse. Okay, he's gone down. So Hunter trying to go for the full 10 second stick gets taken out. Now it's the 1v1. Jack's on half health, roughly. The bomb is already uh, the defuse. Okay, is there to be retrieved, and he has managed to pick it up. But Bubski, will he just go for the swing right now? The bomb is being stuck. Swings out, takes the headshot. Massive one versus three from Bubski. E logo, logo, rapaziada, tem jogo. Rolou. MBR! É. Wallace! Boa jogada, com você fala. E olha o Bubski segurando o dedo. Vai levar mais um, será? Uh, spray, voo do Bubski. Dois apareceram na frente. Spotted out, but manages to find a kill. Jax goes down. Or, sorry, takes down Acor, oh, the 16 HP player from before. Bubski isn't expected to be up top. He's got an angle. Eventually realizes Shox is there. Shox was scoped up, so couldn't see him. With Jax coming up behind, and certainly that is expected. Lobbing a nade in, not going to do a whole lot. They're in a 2v3. Nowhere is safe, but Kenny S gets taken down. Bubski's on the case. Swinging around. He'll catch an angle on Amanek in just a second. Realizes it a little too late, but still gets the headshot. Bubski, the 4k in the round. And what a spectacular showing. Bubski was rapping through T-spawn. And now because he's seen Perfecto in top mid, he, he decides against it. He comes back to around towards Ramp. And he's got to help Roy out. He deals with the first map. What? Follows up onto Boomich. And now just Perfecto left to find. He goes lower. And Bobski's got all three. A stellar round. And, and that there is. Oby tak było. Oby tak było w każdej kolejnej rundzie. Teraz czterech na trzech. Zajęta snajperka przez Morelza, ale ten od razu upada. Te bronie leżą w bardzo niefortunnej pozycji dla Polaków. Teraz jeszcze jest szansa. Teraz jeszcze jest okazja, ale Bubski się rozpędza. Dwa fragi dla niego. I to pozostawia Lunatika w sytuacji klaczowej. Jeden na jednego. Dać nadzieję ekipie Trix, że ten czwarty punkt wpadnie na ich konto. I ten czas, który ucieka, Lunatic szukał rywala, dał się jednak namierzyć, nie ma zestawu do rozbrajania, musiał przechodzić pod bombę, a był już Bubski wychylony. ...things down from the control room, you might even say controlling that round, if you'll pardon the pun. It's a great hold from Bubski, playing it perfectly, winning all of his duels, definitely didn't need to serve more than two kills there, but he locked things down, took advantage of his mistakes, now from back silo, he'll get himself three on the anti-eco and make it back-to-back -back four kids. Now he's gonna be a damsel in distress. He needs his shining. He needs his knight in shining armor, but he doesn't have one. Bubsy's gonna have to go for it. No, there's a player there. He gets the first one. Springs on through. Eliminates Button. And is there enough time? The deep is there. Bubsy's gonna spray on through. Oh no, Bubsy! Oh no, Bubsy! He gets Bubs, last man standing. Probably hear the jumping. Pops oh. out. Very nice headshot there. Is he gonna pick up the AK? Goes for them. The uh, incendiary. Oh! He's gonna get a second! He's got the bomb now and the AWP. <laughs> and, he gets... and he gets the oh. win because the timer ran out. No, that was the. A... You give it up. Was okay, let them take it. Fast play into the A bomb site from Fnatic, but we've got flames everywhere and this might send by variants one of the teams and maybe it will be the Swedes because Bubski is charged up and looking for an ace on the CT side. He'll be denied by Nico and kill before going down. So this is a very costly round at the very least, but it looks like it could actually go in favor of G2. Suddenly Bubski's left alone. We've already seen him save the day once. Can he do it yet again? Spots the head and finishes off that first player who was already low health. And that leaves it all on Nexa now. No kit, of course, he's trying to push and actually force, uh, force the issue, rather. Uh, they're making some questionable economic decisions, Dinko. In the previous round, we said it. It was a risk. It, it paid off at the very beginning, but then they just got torn apart, starting with Hunden spans. And with Kiyoshima falling, pistols overwhelm the site. Or rather, pistols get on the site for a second. 
Bubski deals with them pretty quickly. Yeah, last man is lucky. He's going to be dropped as well, surely, here by Bubski. He secures himself a quad kill. Could they take it away one more time? Oh, There's no. the headshot dropping Roy, and now Bubski. He's going to get the one, but that AWP is still a big issue. He's going to be right on top of it, holding it down the full length of time. Nor coming through. He's on the other side. Oh, nice shot from Bubski. And he's going to be back on it. Man, that is way too close of a round. Peter, уже отличное начало для битвы спор. Но правда, вот... О, Бабски! Whoa, 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 whoa. He's back towards CT spawn. CZ in the A1S. Bomb has been tapped and it's not being stuck. Bubski waits and bides his time. Strikes from beyond the grave. And he's looking for more now. The bomb is being stuck here. And Bubski, he's won the round. Surely, Bubski's won the clutch. One versus two. Except for that, they've got a lot of attention on A, which is that one player looking all the way down. Oh, 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 my. oh come on. The two kills. He's already having a great match. Those are a couple of fantastic USB oh. headshots with the smoke. He's going to make it three. Come Can on. he just go ahead and make it an ace? Come on, make a clip of it. To find this kill. They tap. And he finds another one. On for the ears. The defuse coming through. Bubski. He needs to pull it off. He's not even looking. Oh, the no. smoke comes in and he's off the bomb. It's all on innocent. No, no. Hit. And Bubski pulls it off. They at least do trade back. Like you said, the uh, the five-man long is something that we don't particularly see all that often. Maybe surprise an Epsilon a little bit, but it seems like they will be able to cope for now as Bubski. Oh. He will be able to isolate oh. at least into a oh. one versus one crucial. Comes in towards the B bomb side. It's only Bubsky that's worried about it. He's got an AWP in play, manages to pick up one. Looking for a second as well. There it is. Amanek is down. More on the board. Bubsky, what a defense. Kicker to his crosser. It's Shush. But actually, Buster, two versus two, seven. The bomb is dropped. 15 seconds in. It's only Bubsky left. This is. Bupski, that was a nice uh, spray. Good reply. Beautiful reply, all down to Bubski. One on two, and time is of the essence. Dukes out the first, looks for the second. Damage done, has to regress for him, and he gets it as well. Rotate over to Banana, and on to B. Bubski. Finding one, can you get a second, or third, two, three, and he's getting out just before he could get the fourth. Game of Legion, Bobski's oh. still. <laughs> jump by the Swedish guy. But Bobski is still there and almost winning, winning the round four tweaked with the Desert Eagles. So much grenades and Freddy B is hiding in the corner, but Bobski's got the entry. And again. Through the smoke, what the hell is this guy doing? Just make the jump this time around. Smoke on the bomb. He needs to go for a bit of a spray down here in just a moment. Actually, he peeks through the smoke. Oh, that's a great spray onto Snappy. It's gotta be all on Blame F against Bobby. Not oh, gonna catch it, Blame F. It's gonna be Botsky. You wonder. If this is going to be a possibility for Virtus Pro, they are going to be going oh, in perfect. It. Great flashbang, Bubski with instant headshots onto both players. And Mihu, unfortunately for him, he'd love to be the hero in this scenario, but the smart thing to do is to try and save that AWP. And he's got to try and get away. Bubski's just killing it at the moment. He's gone up. Searson's going to come out the window now. Favon. Oh, that's really good by Searson. He was distracting, making the jumping noises so they look towards him. So Favon could find the kill. Headshot by the 5-7, though. This is dangerous now. That's the problem with having the 5-7. When you die, the opponents can pick it up. Yeah, Bobski and Acorn with this crossfire between sandbags. Oh, Bobski's got two there, just tapping away with the USP. Much better return than he was ever hoping for. Ooh. Oh my goodness! Bobski's pushed up towards the CT spawn. They don't actually know his position, and so he has the chance to maybe catch them off guard, bring this into the one versus ones. Indeed, able to take down Relaxa, falls back towards Monster now, so he can try and play a little bit more for the time. But he takes the peek proactively, catches Freddy B just as he drops the smoke. Halen apareceu, chips também, conseguiu buscar e agora errou de espada. O Bobski vai tirar o plant. Levou o segundo. O terceiro também. Falling into the trap of these Galil forces instead, right? Because you can afford to run them every round at max loss bonus. Oh. They're always trying to go into this with everything they need, but even that. O jogador atravessando smoke, e surpreendendo a defesa. É trocado pelo slow e agora Bubski contra dois. O primeiro ele pega, o segundo também. Sensacional round do Bubski. I was down, no one else is dead. 
and they haven't sprung on this. So he was calling back at that point. A's actually clear. You should come over this side of the map. He realized that just as he goes down, and now they get nothing out of this. So this should be a clean round for Mad Lions, which it is. Five players to survive. Mas a equipe da Contact vem junto. É um 2x1. Lá vem o retake da Contact. Pra tentar trazer de volta agora a posição privilegiada. Levou o primeiro. O segundo tá ali pela frente. O Chips faz a movimentação. Agora já sabe da posição também. Aqui o Bobski vai tentando buscar. E deu essa palaça! 2 contra 1, um, Bubski no clutch, C4 plantada, tem um jogador muito meado, se levar esse primeiro fica legal. É o disparo, consegue ali estrevar, aparece aí. Nossa, uma Sonic máquina. Na tela lança, dele. lança, lança. E é o Bubski contra 2, fecha, abre. Ganha por tempo, confirma o HS, uma máquina, Bubski. Tem que clear things out and get into the site. Bubski is going to have to plant safe, but there's really nothing safe at the moment, and that's a great shot, a great fake to bring Taco out. Unbelievable, he knows exactly where Fallen is coming from as well. Coming through the window, Bubski with another headshot, a triple kill. Behind the smoke, it's Shush with another Samba Young trade. Surprise, surprise. Bubski's going to try and chase him down. Nice kill in the one-on-one -on -one now. It's Chopper in heaven. Bubski's going back for a gun. Ooh. Will he be ready for this? Oh, the barrel was there and someone called it, I think. Uh, oh, there we yeah, go. He's given yeah. up too much and now Bubski knows. He's aware that Chopper's wow. here and he secures. Motov for the players of the Liquid Esports. Bubski is через дым. Минус по алмазеру все же есть. Также еще оставляет одного красного игрока. Если не ошибаюсь, это был Джерри. Флешка для Бубски. Выходит он спиной. Здесь вышел и Джерри. Минус два в исполнении Бубски. И остается последний игрок. Это Флит. Um pouquinho... Reinauguração da loja. Olha só o vacilo ali. O Asilion passava, mas o Chip vai aparecer no Mag 7. O Bubski dessa vez não vacilou. Levou dois jogadores, garante a vantagem. Agora vai ficar com os jogadores lá do bomb site da A, já plantando a C4, garantindo toda aí a segurança. E apenas aí o Bubski já fez o trabalho sujo dele. Três eliminações para garantir o round, Nicão, num round econômico, num stack bomb site da B. Muito bem trabalhado ali. A Mad Lions não sofreu muitas. Pode esquecer que tem o Jonge exatamente nas costas. Levou esse. O segundo se esconde. Chama no combate o mid. Vai levar melhor. Levou o segundo. Mas aí 40 segundos. E o Bubski tem que enfrentar os dois em junto. Peter com a pistola na mão. E aí ele vai levar esse. O segundo tá do lado. Se desensina aí do disparo. Agora sabe da posição do Crashes. Great step in, forced back out to try to do the damage, as now he's the last man standing, Taps are doing damage, oh, Bavski's finishing off with more spray, another 2k for the quad kill.